What's up, YouTube? I hope you're having a blessed day. Um, it's morning for me. I just woke up, but it, it, it is actually almost 5 o'clock p.m. Uh, the joys of working nights, I tell you. Um, but anyway, I just woke up to a package at my front door. Something I've been waiting for. This is a black box. And that's it. That, that, that's, it. that's all. Thanks for watching, guys. No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. This is the, it's a 50 in 1 uh, kit for your GoPro. Um, I got it off Amazon for 20 bucks. It's a $60 kit that they sell in there for 20 bucks. I mean, it's, it's awesome. So we're about to open it up. I barely, I just pulled it out of the packaging and came in. Haven't opened it up. So here we go. And a mess. No. Look at all this plastic. Okay, so <clears throat> let's get into it real quick. Let's see what this is. This, ah, it's the chest rig. This is something I'm going to look forward to because I actually, oh, it's elastic too. It stretches. <clears throat> I'm going fishing soon. So this is something that I am glad I want to use, or I'm glad I want to use. This is something I'm going to want to use. I'm glad it stretches. It's gracious. Probably need to, to adjust it though. Oh yeah. Pretty sweet. See it has that little thing right there that uh, you can put the, uh, the GoPro in. Put a little mount in there. That's pretty awesome. Alright, see what else we got. Oh, it's the suction cup. That's cool. All right, suction cup. Ha! Sweet. Look at that. It's pretty neat. Suction cup is awesome. All right, moving on. Oh, cool. Just a little, just a little clip. Man, we got a whole bunch of goodness, and this is just one side of it. All right, let's see what we got. Oh, the head rig. Let's see what else we got here. Pretty cool. It's a wrist rig, and it it swivels. Pretty awesome. A floaty. Let's see. Oh, we got a little lens looking cleaner right there and I don't know what this would be used for I wouldn't know what to do with that if you guys know let me know cuz I have no clue what that would be used for curved mounts and flat ones curved and flat mounts so here's a flat one here's a curved one pretty cool let's see what we got here Oh, the monopod. How awesome is this? It's a selfie stick. That's what it is. It's a selfie stick. I'm going to try I'm going to try this out. This is pretty cool. I'm going to walk around public like this. Hey! That's pretty cool. Ooh, and a tripod. A flexible tripod. That's pretty cool. That's going to come in handy whenever I have something that I can tie this around. This stuff is awesome. So right now I'm gonna go outside and I'm gonna use some of it. Sister wetted me. She did. Yes. We gotta get the mud off of it. Sweet. Here's the head rig. It looks funny, but it's pretty cool. So that, that footage you just saw was from this. So now I'm gonna go put on another one. He wetted me. What's up, girl? Hey, Carly. Ah. Oh, so you sweet boy. Back. You sweet boy.
So that is the chest rig, which is pretty sweet. I'll be using it soon at the lake. This one is on the wrist mount and it swivels. There go the girls walking the bulldogs. That is what it looks like. Right there, not bad. It's pretty cool. So this is on the stick, the monopod. It's actually not bad. And it stretches way out there, I mean, you can get. So there's the uh, monopod. It swivels, so it's pretty neat. Pretty neat little contraption. So this is the flexible tripod. It's pretty neat because it it bends and it's flexible. I'll show you what I'm talking about here in a little bit. I got the little tripod wrapped around my antenna, and I'll show you what that looks like. Um, and that's what it looks like. You can wrap around just about anything. And, I mean, that's pretty sweet if you ask me. So, done with the GoPro attachments. I'm actually using the flex flexible bipod right now. Um, I, I think it's pretty sweet. It's not big, but it's, it's sweet. But anyway, um, we are going to put together that metal shelf that I talked about a few videos ago. I'm going to put it together and uh, try and get this thing somewhat organized tonight before I go to work. That way we can start seeing exactly what we're going to do uh, in this garage. It'll start opening up. So uh, anyway, that's what we're going to do now. So talk to you when we're done. So right after I said we were going to build the shelf, the food was ready. We had some chili dogs. Really good. Anyway, so I went in and did that. Now it's getting dark and my garage light doesn't exactly isn't exactly bright it's more of that mellow yellow toned down light so in order for y'all to see anything that I'm about to do I gotta get a brighter light we were at a friend's house the other day and um, we went into his house and his house was really bright. And I asked him, you know, man, where, how do you get your, you know, what kind of light do you get to, to get that bright, you know, of a, of a light and everything. And he told me, so that's what I'm going to get. Hopefully it'll light up the garage the way I want it to. As you can see, the sun is in my face. It's literally touching the horizon over there. So that is what we are doing now. So we're heading to Lowe's. Get a light, go back, put it in, and uh, start start building that shelf. Hopefully, I can get it done before I go to work. It's 7:50. It's almost 8, 8 p.m. So hopefully, hopefully I can get it done before I go to work. So. Just because it's Academy, I don't need to come here, but I'm going to see what they got. I need a new rod and reel. Just because. 
So now I understand how my wife feels when she goes shopping because, you know, I don't get mad at her for buying stuff. And now I don't know why. I know why it's so hard for her not to go somewhere and not buy stuff because it's kind of dark. But a rod, reel, and tackle combo for 40 bucks. Can't beat that. And just to top it off, Predator Call, Dying Rabbit. I'm going coyote hunting next week. I need a Predator Call. I'm going fishing in two weeks. So I need a rod and reel. So anyway, we're going to head home now. All right, we're home now. That line in Lowe's was ridiculous. There was one cashier, and that was it. Just one cashier. So anyway, that's what we got. We got some uh, bright white bulbs that's going to replace that one. It's not very bright in here, as you can tell. So uh, let me do that real quick. Get the wife's car moved in, and uh, I'll talk to you here in a minute. All right, so here's what it looks like now. What it looks like now. I think that is significantly better. See the same light looking at the same box. Oh yeah. Didn't have that yellow, doesn't have that yellow tint to it. It's awesome, already awesome. So I'm gonna move my wife's car in and uh, I'm gonna go inside. Well guys, I ran out of time, so I'm getting ready for work. Um, so that's gonna be it for today. Uh, hope you enjoyed it. Tomorrow I'm going to try and get that shelf built and uh, let you guys see that. So hopefully I can uh, get it done and get some other stuff done that i got to do around the house. Uh, just remember that you're fearfully and wonderfully made and God has a specific calling on your life. If you'll just reach out to Him and seek His will, He'll direct you. He'll direct your path. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you next time.